In other news now, a Chinese fleet is in Hawaii for the RIM of the Pacific or RIMPAC multinational naval exercise. RIMPAC, which started in 1971 and was held every two years, is the world's largest multinational maritime military exercise. Dessa Senas is there for the report. RIMPAC 2014, or RIM of the Pacific Exercises, began on Thursday here in Hawaii. And for the first time, China's People's Liberation Army Navy is participating in hopes that it can show to the United States that it is willing to cooperate in maintaining security in the Pacific region. China's National Defense Ministry spokesman Yang Yu Jun at a press conference said message sent by the Chinese Naval's first involvement in the RIMPAC naval exercises cannot be underestimated. He states, quote, Joining this exercise is conducive to deepening professional exchange and practical cooperation among the Chinese and other participating navies and improving the capability in dealing with multiple security threats. Eugene further said that China's participation shows that though the two countries differ on certain issues, they have been building trust. China sent four warships to Hawaii, the missile destroyer Haiku, the missile frigate Yuiyang, the supply ship Kwandao Hu, and the hospital ship Peace Ark, with two helicopters aboard, a commando and diving units, totaling about 1,100 servicemen. It is estimated that the Chinese forces rank the second largest contingency in this year's RIMPAC next to the U.S. This year's theme is Capable Adaptive Partners. Likewise, joining the exercise for the first time is Brunei. The 2014 RIMPAC exercise will focus on developing maritime safety and security capabilities. The participating nations and forces will exercise a wide range of capabilities and demonstrate the inherent flexibility of maritime forces. From Hawaii, Desa Senas, Eagle News.